In the Italian port city of Trieste, officers from the country's financial police service take possession of a very unusual property. This is Sailing Yacht A, described as the world's biggest sailing yacht. It's more than 140 metres in length and it has a price tag of nearly $600 million. And this was the man who owned it, Russian billionaire Andrei Melnichenko. He made his fortune in coal and fertiliser, but he's also reputed to be a close confidant of Vladimir Putin. A few days ago, his name was added to a list of people being sanctioned by the European Union. Another extremely expensive yacht, another Russian oligarch. This is the Solaris, which belongs to Roman Abramovich, seen anchored off the coast of Montenegro. Congratulations. No sign of its owner, who's been sanctioned by the UK government. The fallout from that continued, with Mr Abramovich being disqualified as a director of Chelsea FC, the club he still owns. In a statement, the English Premier League said following the imposition of sanctions by the UK government, the Premier League board has disqualified Roman Abramovich as a director of Chelsea Football Club. The board's decision does not impact on the club's ability to train and play its fixtures, as set out under the terms of a licence issued by the government, which expires on the 31st of May. Be it football clubs, be it mega yachts, the West's campaign against the oligarchs of Russia goes on. Tim Allman, BBC News.